Is this Donkey Kong? Oh, these are pretty cool bananas. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's, his eyeballs go out. Why is Donkey Kong going Super Saiyan? And 64 Donkey Kong. That's the one Donkey Kong game that I skipped. And now I feel like I regret it, man. I want a Super Saiyan Donkey Kong. Anyway, what's cracking gamers and welcome to another video game meme session out here I am somewhat of a gamer myself, and I'm also somewhat of a birthday boy <laughs> So yeah, it's my birthday right now. I'm gonna be doing like a 12-hour friggin subathon on my twitch channel right there You guys are free to come around. I have plenty of surprises. I have a wheel full of punishment I mean rewards for uh, you guys and you know it's just random it's gonna be spinning pretty much all day around I have plenty of fun events happening and apparently I even got a surprise from Ashley in one way or another about videos and other surprises so just come on check it out but for now uh, birthday boy things aside we got some video game means to check out let's get to it overwatch 2 PVE is reported completely cancelled says Dexterito, and uh, seems like we have a video response. Monsieur, does this mean Overwatch is back? Yeah, look at that dumpty on. I mean, I mean, what? Anyway, is monkey? Oh, he's not a monkey. I mean, I, I, I go mad if I say that. No. <laughs> I always thought that Overwatch 2 PvE was canceled already, but you know, they just they just canceled it so hard It was canceled twice man. You know, why is it even called Overwatch 2 at this point? It's it's just Overwatch <laughs> They just regressed <laughs> Oh man, it's been a while since I've seen a Tears of the Kingdom build out here. All right Hey, oh, is that a is that like a hug machine? It is indeed a hug machine Squeezing the Lionel to death with love and affection. <laughs> that thing, it can't escape the hug. It's actually very well done there. Doesn't even use that much energy. It just hugs things to death. Very impressive machine. Very powerful too. An animatronic. <laughs> Was that the bite of 87? <laughs> Ain't no way, bro. Bro actually got bite of 87 at the end. Hilarious. <laughs> Why would you stick your head in that? How stupid are you, man? I'm assuming the man is fine, though, so we'll, we'll be all right. Oh, yeah, he's alive. Vietnamese TikToker. That's just one of his vids. Okay, good. When your friend doesn't revive you in a game. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. <laughs> and he goes down. Eh. <laughs> Chino, Chino, please, res me, bro. Res me, stop cranking 90s, bro. <laughs> I've always got, uh, Gilly's grab my card. <laughs> hey, man, nothing really gets you as heated as when you're gaming with your friends, man. If you can't call your friends some mean things, <laughs> I'm not gonna go any further than that. Can I have a please a great awesome? Kratos, I okay. I Kratos. 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 Oh. Depends on the weapon and the man. Holy! He is definitely worth- Oh my god, his voice! Depends on the weapon and the man. I am Kratos. I mean, I- I- I honestly, even with the reverb and everything that he did, that was insane. I don't even think I have the power to be Kratos. Boy. <laughs> hey, yo, Raku guy with a Pal World comic. Yo, hey, Masanda, don't worry about these trees. I need your help somewhere else. <laughs> oh, it just picks it up and um, side muscle. <laughs> All right, yeah, I got it out there. I like side chesto, not side muscle, noble. Remember your freaking anime. Anyway, plops the big guy down and can you take care of these berry fields? Great. It's just not. <laughs> I mean, those those little Mossanda guys, uh, they're apparently really light. If they jump in the air, they float down, okay? They're just really light, but I do get the fact that it is kind of strange that our hero can literally pick up anything, any sort of pal, and just toss them around like they're nothing. It's insane, dude. So here we have everyone out here just looking as the Elden Ring Shadow of the Earth Tree DLC is just cooking right before us. Cooking. <laughs> Looking out oh, is so delicious. So tantalizing the taste. If it's so close. It's so close now, isn't it? 
Uh, here we have Kale. <laughs> That's the dogs coming to come bite you. Jeez, that's intimidating. What a shot there. That's an amazing shot. But also, that is what you see when you go to Kale too. Absolutely. So, got treated for back pain at the American Hospital. They took one million six hundred sixty thousand five hundred eighty-one and forty-four cents from you. Close. That doesn't seem all right. That's not just a a close kind of situation that's like hey let's talk kind of situation wait a minute <laughs> you're telling me i lost over 1.5 million now what the heck so miyazaki saying you know what we should put right next to the starting area and the starting area being there and next to it is literal heck <laughs> okay. just just for people to wander through you know just get in there guys Ooh, scarlet Ooh, scarlet rod isn't that fun <laughs> and then also a teleport directly into the middle of red heck there too that's a really fun thing that he could just include in there that's always fun all right 50 all right some ping 56 ping oh um okay, okay. kind of all right almost Okay, <laughs> like, uh, you good, man? Uh, <laughs> wait, is that still going? <laughs> okay, dude, that was a cheeky meme. I don't really have to deal with lag issues anymore, but I mean, back in the day. Yeah, you, you saw people warping around 24-7. Or if I guess if it's like the start of an, like, any MMO, usually it's always horrific what happens. So, we have a news headline, Dragon's Dogma 2 still doesn't have fast travel, as the director says, you only need it because the game is boring. The Capcom sequel wants you to stumble upon things. And then, the real reason, they wanted to sell you fast traveling microtransactions with the warp locator. And so this is why Capcom is trying to prevent mods. And I cannot believe that they actually included fast travel microtransactions in a $70 single player game where you cannot delete your save file, you're stuck with what you are, and there's a microtransaction to change the look of your character. The game is probably enjoyable, and but there's so many things wrong with this picture, man. I mean, it's got an overwhelmingly negative review on Steam right now, so it's it's not Dragon's Dogma, it's Dragon's Dog shit. <laughs> if you get my picture. I don't care how sale 20% off you are. I'm not paying $47.99 for Mario Kart Deluxe 8 when Mario Kart 8 Deluxe released April 28th, 2017. It's quite some time ago there, lads. <laughs> Coming up about seven years ago, and it's still $47.99. I, I cannot fathom how Nintendo never marks down the price of their games, and I... And they, and they wonder why people will pirate. I'm just saying, they're trying... I'm just saying, man. I mean, granted, though, they at least do, um, you know, update the game and give you lots of extra tracks with the DLC. So it's been updating over all these years. So, I mean, there's still sub stuff going on, but probably would sell better if, you know, if it was cheaper. Oh, actual Dragon's Dogma 2 with all your pawns. All right. Yep. All right. And jump. Yeah. That's immediately what happened to me as well. Oh, the other pawns fell down, too. <laughs> Oh! <laughs> Use a wake stone, held one. Hey, everybody just did the flop out there. I'm hoping that the wake stone is not like a paid DLC uh, extra resurrection for mid combat because that would be ridiculous. Um, man, I didn't, I did not expect that. Which way, Western Dev? As we have Stellar Blade uh, Two, I believe it is on the left, and Overwatch Tracer on the right, and there seems to be something missing. <laughs> something mysteriously missing, which is kind of sad because, you know, they also got rid of Solid Snake's booty. Why do, why do people get rid of the booty? I don't understand. Why are we scared of the booty? This, this shouldn't be happening. Let them have their booty. So comic by many arts. Hey, Peach, check this out. Help. Someone help me, please! I'm a coming, darling! As Luigi rushes to the rescue and, well, he got a cramp. <laughs> and couldn't quite get there in time. I mean, I think the reason that we all like Luigi, and I also do like the Hawaiian one-up mushroom shirt out there, uh, is, the, is the fact that he is so pathetic. The Mario Brothers, like, 
couple of games really drove home the fact that he was kind of a silly goofy goober and also paper mario and things like i i like that about him he's he's supposed to be lovingly pathetic like most of us are <laughs> But the fact is, though, when he does put his mind to it, he is capable of saving the day. So that's also the good quality. He's not just a bumbling idiot. He has the power, but he just needs to believe. Mira sighed with a comic. My lord, you are so... Hey. Turns around. Do you want help eating that? It's a snake, right? <laughs> it's the rest of the cast is behind there from Dungeon Mesh. Oh, no. I mean, to be fair, he probably would eat Riker. If it was right there, even though it's kind of all writhing, but they would cook it at the very least. I don't know if there's going to be DLC that she's going to be like maybe some boss after consuming whatever that guy was, you know, and she becomes another villain could be interesting. I don't know. But we can only just guesstimate what's going to happen in the DLC. I'm curious. The internet has forever poisoned my mind. I can't look at this loading screen in Skyrim without laughing and... I mean, it would be kind of intimidating, but oh man, all I see are the stupid soy jack faces. What's wrong? I mean, at least it's not like a, a Sussus Among Us looking thing. Anyway, that's gonna do it here for our video game meme session here. Hope you guys enjoyed it as always. Again, you know, I got plenty of other videos for you guys to check out. Many loves to all of you for staying with me for another birthday out here. Much love to you guys, and uh, hope to see you beautiful sons of guns again in the next video.